Okay, so we took care of the villains, traitors, whatever you might call them. So now it's time for us to report back. Nice ass. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me tonight. Just got some new energy. So it's been a while since I've played this, so I'm trying to remember the controls. Okay, it looks like we have a quest. Lieutenant Zachariah Manser, your reputation precedes you. A promotion well deserved, I hear. I'm Quartermaster Ryan Stewart, in charge of logistics in this barracks. Equipment problems or improvement, or you need to collect your pay, I'm your man. Pleasure, Quartermaster. Word on the street is that the locusts are swarming the underworks. Patrol gonna get it under control before the shit hits the fan? <laughs> Unlikely. High command's about as interested in the slums as they are the underworks. Might try to spit shine a turd. And what's it to you anyway? As it goes, little nuisances have a way of becoming big problems over time. Proliferation. And I'd be willing to pay to nip it in the bud now, before they start to hit our warehouses and personnel, too. Well, you'd have more luck killing them in their nests than hunting them one by one. Or you could booby trap the tunnels and catch the rats while they roam. Your call. All right. Where's my bed? Okay, I know we need to report back to her, but we're going to do that for last, because um, this is kind of like one of those chapter games where, um... Where's my bedroom? Oh, my personal quarters, it's over here. But, um, it's one of those games where it's like, uh, you... You can miss certain things. We're going to sleep till dawn. Alright, so... Oh yeah, we got some... Oh. We do have some new equipment. Nice. I'm gonna put this on. Oh. I really don't 
I really just use the saps, so... Mm. I'll give you that. And maybe we can break down some of the stuff that we have. <clears throat> I mean, it's still considering this the better upgrade because of the uh, little, or the better um, equipment because of the upgrade we have on it. Keeping his rifle. Oh, I forgot to uh, actually upgrade my gear. Um, we need to level up our crafting. So what is crafting? Yeah, we need to level up our crafting. But I can get. Physical resistance, which would be nice. So we're gonna get physical resistance. All right. Oh, and I forgot that the main reason why I decided to do that was journal. Finding Earth, which we'll do that. Why is that they actually wanted us to kill the deserters? Alright. We'll take those. Fortunately, this is beyond my skill level. Alright. Can't search that? Okay. So we are going to now not go that way. I guess we're gonna go this way for right now. We're gonna go back down to the slums. Or underworks, I guess. Not the right way. I'll take everything. I didn't. I 
That's weird. Um, I can't keep going down, but I need to be on this level for... I think this is where we... Can't go down that way. Or yes, we can. We just gotta go the other way. Sorry, it's been a while since I played this, so I'm a little lost. Oh, it's a shortcut. Okay, this was stupid. Uh, finally. And let's take everything. Alright, so we don't lose karma whenever we're um, draining the serum from the... Uh, beasts, because, you know, they're non-sentient animals, I guess. I don't know, it's kind of confusing. But we don't lose karma from, uh, draining serum from, uh, creatures. Only from people. Although I will say we gain more, uh, more serum from people. So, you know, it's supposed to be like a little trade-off. Alright, and I think that's, yeah, that's all the serum we can get. So now we go over here. Oh, there's just nothing we can search. No, I'll take it. Okay, we just gotta be careful. We gotta play smart. Careful. Oh crap. Oh no, 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 we're not doing this right now. No, 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 I did not mean to make you angry. Oh, thank goodness. Oh god. No, 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 no.
Okay, new plan. We stand right here, we let our health regain, and then we'll go and kill them. At your command, Lieutenant. Well, while we're here. What can you tell me about our captain? I'm... Sorry, Lieutenant? I want you to speak freely. It's just us. No, uh, of course, Lieutenant. I just... Uh, the captain's a great lady. A bit strict and not always polite with her orders, but that's nothing to bitch about. Sure, she's got her reasons, and it's for her own good. And, hell, she knows a lot more than what's going on behind the scenes than we do. Hell, she came from a family of officers. She's damn good at her job. Was meant for it. And I'm pretty damn proud to say she's the head of our unit. I I'm just a, a little surprised you're asking me, Lieutenant. What do you think about Technomancers? Oh, hell. <laughs> well, you're putting me on the spot, aren't you? <sighs> Alright, well, you guys are strong and all that with your powers, no doubt. And honestly, you're only the second one I've ever met. First guy was at our place in Green Hope. He was a nice old guy. He, uh, he, he taught us some terrestrial techniques, and, you know, obviously he was there for us if we had spiritual problems. But, to be honest, I can't really compare him to you or any of the other ones here, of course. That said, honestly, I'm really proud to serve under you, Lieutenant. You're an example to try to live up to. I mean, you were just one of us regular people, and you became an officer and a technomancer. It's really incredible and inspiring. All right, full health. Let's get back to it. Okay, I wasn't even trying to fight these things. Where do they go? Thank God we leveled up. Definitely leveling up my Technomancy. Hmm. Big ugly beasties they are. Um, oh yeah. Uh, power. Oh shit, I'm gonna die. trying to aggro them yet. Though we do need to go over there. Alright, so... Oh. Aha, I thought I missed one. Surely I can climb back up. I can climb back up there. Yep, yes I can. And there's more of them. Alright, we're gonna... Since we're close to this one, uh... Alright, 
Just gotta be quick. Damn it! I was really hoping I would not die. Oh, let's see what happens. Okay, at least the autosaves are very forgiving. So I'm very happy about that. Need to get them clustered up closer to here. Now just have big mama. Ooh. Good job. Okay. Alright, the game isn't necessarily difficult, it's just I'm just bad right now. Um, like I said, it's been a little over a year since I've played this, so I've kind of forgotten all the controls. It's actually a really fun game. Alright. And the last nest was down here. I think I should just pop a save right here. Slowly lead them to us. Okay, that wasn't too bad. So yeah, the best strategy for dealing with them is just aggroing them barely, and then leaving their, I guess, territory, and just slowly whittling them down. Always deal with the small fries first, and then deal with the big one. What are they called? Locusts? They call them locusts here?
I can't tell if the Technomancy powers... Nah, they, they don't work as effectively on them, I don't think. These guys are electric by nature. Search the dead guy. And blow up their nest. Report back to Ryan Stewart. Not bad, but I'm pretty sure we have more missions that we can do. We're going to turn this one off for right now. Back the way we came. Okay, not too bad. I think with their moves, though, it's a little bit more predictable. No, 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 do not aggro them. Okay, I guess we're aggroing them. Oh, it's a lot easier when there's only the small ones. I'll take that. I'll take this. And let's do this level up real quick. Um, warrior. Increases the chance of critical or fast attacks by 50%, or increases disrupting effects uh, or fast attack by 10%. Critical or fast by 5, or disrupting effect of fast attacks by 10. Um, I think critical is better. They're gonna see us. Yeah, that was like...
What the hell was that? It said tick. Okay. I'm gonna see what's in here. Take everything. And take everything. Oh, isn't this like the the vault thing? Sean was right. Can't open this door without another technomancer. Ah, okay. It's probably something we'll come back to at a later time. So we can either go this way and up a zigzaggy staircase. What do you think we're gonna do? Alright, well I guess we're gonna report back to this guy. Just so we can get our reward real quick. Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? It took a little work, but I found and destroyed the locust nests. Should quiet the invasion a bit. Fast work, Lieutenant. Gotta say it's a change of pace to see someone with rank give a damn about the little people. Doesn't happen all that often. It's your lucky day. I need a favor, if you have the time, on top of the missions the captain already gave you. Depends on the favor. Soldiers back from the front are barricaded inside the warehouse. But they think Aurora's outside and they're in the middle of a war zone. They've terrorized the merchants, but honestly, that's not even the worst of it. According to internal reports, they're not just soldiers. They're test subjects for a new combat drug that increases their strength tenfold. The paranoia is probably a result of the drug. But it makes the situation even more dangerous. I would prefer it if you could reason with them. You could use force. But in their state, the drugs could push them over the edge. A straight up fight could kill them. First things first, we need to help get them quarantined and away from civilians to prevent further collateral damage. I know you're up to your neck in other responsibilities, but please. This is a favor for me and a favor for the guys. If the ASC handles it instead, I know I'm gonna be writing letters of condolences. Don't let it come to that. How does he think a noob who's not even a real soldier will be able to reason with a corporal hopped up on some super drug? He knows technomancers aren't magicians, right? Pipe down, Lieutenant will find a way. Maybe we just need to find the corporal's family to help talk him down. Look at me, <laughs> I'm just full of ideas.